So this user writes in and says, imagine 500 pounds worth of hamburger helper. And that's a pretty grim description of what I'm about to tell you. So morgue stories, here they come. Uh, so this person was a lab assistant in the medical examiner's office and she worked the night shift, usually meant she was working alone and between two freezers stocked with various bits, and body parts and things of that of individuals um, that normally the doctor may need for an autopsy or they just held on to them for the religious pur purposes and things like that or a police investigator may need a finger for fingerprints, stuff like that. Um, so they get all kinds of death that needs to be verified. And they have some rather interesting cases. Um, she also had some that were rather annoyances. And annoyance is part of the detachment, which I did kind of cover in my previous story. Um, so they have to become detached from this job. Otherwise, it would just eat them alive. And especially when you're seeing about 100 corpses a week, uh, individuals that um, also were extremely obese or morbidly obese and this uh, writer actually tells us that one that sticks out to her was a um, person that was well over 500 pounds they were hit by a car and he uh, their car was hit and they were ejected from the car and then at that high speed and being ejected from the car they were then hit by an 18 wheeler the fun part was to actually attempt to piece all of this back together so that they could perform x-rays and other things re uh, revolved around the actual autopsy, which I'm not really sure they would have needed one, but they had to pull all the parts together and they were basically in buckets uh, because you have to clean up the actual scene and then piece it back together uh, so that way you at least have what makes up the human remains for the proper burial. So imagine that, um, having to piece together that extreme mess.